So what would you say that my skin concern is after looking at it? You got eczema? <laughs> <laughs> no! Good morning and welcome back to my channel. I am about to make a coffee for me and Steven. I did not get very good sleep last night. I think in my last vlog I told you about Cooper's leg. He ended up having surgery, so I'm gonna give you an update. But first, I'm gonna make some coffee. Good morning. Thank you. So this is the current situation. I told you guys that we've been struggling with his legs. If you're squeamish, then don't watch. But yeah, he had TPLO surgery to repair his torn ACL and meniscus. So we moved the guest mattress into the bedroom. Is that a little excessive? Maybe. I mean, would a normal person just put the dog bed on the floor and let him sleep on the floor? Probably. Did we do that? Absolutely not. I would never ask my dog to sleep on the floor. It's like a two month recovery, but the first two weeks are rough. Like, can't really put much weight on it. We have to sling him every time he goes to the bathroom. And not to mention, he's on like four different pain meds and two of them are sedatives. And he's so relaxed that poop literally just keeps sliding you out of his butt. You don't need to tell them YouTube that. <laughs> you don't need to tell them that. Well. Sorry, but it's true. He just keeps pooping. That's why, that's why we have the towel down. So yeah, that's real life. Just figured we'd be transparent over here. Anyway, I'm gonna go get my coffee and I'll see you in a minute. I like a bit of milk in my coffee. Ooh. So today we are just gonna be hanging around. I mean, since Cooper's kind of out of commission uh -huh. and pooping himself. We don't really want to leave him for super long. So I think we'll probably just hang out over on my Instagram, which I'll tag in the description below. I did a poll for my people to decide a makeup look for me. So I think I'm going to do that today. I'm going to drink my coffee and after I do, I'll see you guys. Okay, a little change of scenery because the room that I usually do my makeup in is now Cooper's room. I just threw my hair in a little braid to get out of the way. I did my AM skincare routine, so let me know if you want to see that and I'll do a video on it. But now I am going to do the makeup look that my friends on Instagram picked for me. So. A couple of days ago, I put up some pictures of some eyeshadow options, some blush options, and some lipstick options. And they voted for what look they wanted to see. My hair is already falling out. This is going to end up out. But anywho, I will show you what they picked. So eyeshadow, I feel like they're challenging me. They want me to use the Earth and Sky palette. And they're really pretty. I've used this before. But it's not my typical summer go-to. This I used a lot in the fall. And then they picked Coral Blush. And... Living Coral lipstick. Fresh face, just did my skincare routine, and I am gonna start. Obviously, I'm starting with nothing on, so I am using other things other than those three. I'm not gonna do any liquid foundation today. I'm just gonna do some concealer. Just going for a real light look. First, I'm gonna take down my hair, so. Okay, I got my little clips in, and I am just gonna get started. I always like to put my concealer on first, so when I'm not wearing foundation, all I do is just go over any of my blemishes. Luckily, right now, I'm not in too bad of shape, but I still have really bad discoloration, so I think I talked about that in another one of my videos. I have melasma real bad. It's hormonal hyperpigmentation, little dark spots on my skin. It's not from sun damage, but sun and heat all the things can exacerbate it and make it worse and I look like a psycho person but I'm just gonna leave this right now because especially under your eyes when you put concealer on you want to leave it so that it partially dries and it gets a little tacky the coverage is gonna be like 10 times better I am also gonna go ahead and put some on my lids to prime my lids this just helps the color stay on a little bit better for me it helps with creasing so I don't let that one sit I'm sure you could but while I'm waiting for the other stuff to dry ish and tack up I just start my eyeshadow the one thing that I am going to use that's not in one of the palettes or in the eyeshadow palette that was voted on is this uh, beige color or this neutral color. It, I use it as an all over. And once again, it's just kind of priming my lids. I work it all the way up to my brow with this blender brush. So that's that. I am going to go ahead and start blending out my discoloration or where I put the concealer. See, <sighs> this concealer is amazing. Thank you. 
This is the palette that I'm working with. If you didn't watch my last vlog, all of my stuff has pre and probiotics in it. So this has a probiotic in it. It's healthy, it's gonna feed your skin. I am going to start with this brush so I can pack it on. It's not a blender brush. And I'm gonna be real careful because it's dark. I'm gonna just take my blender brush and blend it out. Uh, I did go under my eyes. So when you take the same base shade on your bottom lashes, I focus it just on this outer part, but it really kind of frames your eyes super nicely and opens them up a little bit. I always try and get some on my brush and then tap off the excess pigment so it's not way too intense. And also as a rule of thumb, when you swirl your brush around, even if you tap it off the first place that you touch your eye, that color is gonna be the most concentrated. It's gonna be the darkest. So you've gotta keep that in mind. And just keep blending, always blend. Blend, blend, blend. going to add a little like a tiny tiny bit more concealer in the center that I'm gonna blend in with my finger and that's just gonna help the green color that I'm gonna do on the base of my lid it's gonna help it stick a little bit better and make it a tad more pigmented the next shade that I'm going to use is that Spanish moss shade I like to do my lid colors that I want to be a little more pigmented with my finger just because I find it works a little better than with a brush So then it doesn't look like two separate shades. It looks like that green is just slowly dying off into the brown, which I prefer instead of like a start, unless you're doing a cut crease, I prefer that it's blended out so it looks like one shade that's gradually changing rather than two harsh thingy-majiggies. Okay, now I'm gonna use this brush. I don't want the gold to be as heavily packed as I did the green, because I'm just gonna do it like slightly in the middle as a little accent because the green already has a gold undertone. So I'm just gonna lightly pat this brush. Tap, tap, tap. And I'm gonna go in the middle. I'm gonna take the brown pencil and I'm only gonna work from the middle, from the center of my lid out because that's doing the same thing as when you put the eyeshadow on the bottom. It's really opening up your eyes. It's framing your eyes and it's opening them up to make them look a little bit bigger because I've got almond shaped eyes, they look small. you just give up. I was trying to be cute and not put my hair up in a bun, but sometimes you just have to give up and realize you, you're not that cute. Okay, I'm now gonna go in with my powder foundation. This has the prebiotic in it too. The coverage of this is absolutely insane. So even though I didn't use liquid foundation, I just used concealer, I'll still get a really nice coverage um, for my discoloration. And I'm using the shade Nude. I'll link what I'm using below, but this is my summer color. I'm gonna go in with some bronzer now, the highlighting bronzer quad. This is one of my favorites. I use it for eyeshadow, I use it for bronzer, I use it for filling in my brows, all the things. <laughs> If you're gonna do bronzer on your forehead, make sure that you blend into your hairline because you don't wanna see like orange and then the white of your scalp. The next thing that was chosen for me is the coral blush and I just kind of swirl around and then I do this thing to make my cheeks look a little cheruby. <laughs> highlight and then
and then I'm gonna do some mascara and then my lip and that is it. is my lipstick and the people chose living coral probably not what I would have picked with the green but it's fine we're gonna we're gonna just go for it so here we are this is the completed look let me take my hair down look a little bit more like a girl everything looks so much better when you finish and I'm gonna be honest the lips are kind of growing on me what are your thoughts Shout out to Instagram for my makeup look. I figured that would be fun to do the tutorial with you guys. I did do a before and after picture, but that's over on my Instagram. So I put my handle below. Go follow me. I'm a huge fan. Okay, well then I guess I'll bring you to brunch with us. So see you in a bit. Let me get dressed. We are on the way to brunch. It's literally right down the road and I'm already feeling guilty because you know, Cooper. So we'll be back home soon. But Steven asked if he could do my makeup. So I thought it might be fun if I give him the same products that were voted on on Instagram that I just did a tutorial on, except Steven will do a tutorial. On you, not on himself. Right, on me. I told him he could do my makeup. So stay tuned for that. We're gonna go eat and then head back home, check on Coop and Steven will be doing a makeup tutorial. So I've got my breakfast enchiladas. Their breakfast potatoes are so good. The bacon and jam, he's gonna add to his chicken and biscuits. Cheers. <laughs> We finished brunch, it was absolutely amazing. We are running home to see our koopy. Okay, we are back, hair is back in a bun. And Cooper was sitting up, or actually he was standing up when I got home and he was not pleased that we were gone, but he's happy we're back. So we are going to watch a little TV and then Steven is going to do my makeup. So that should be interesting, we'll keep you updated. Okay. Steven's been asking to do my makeup, so he's gonna take the same look that was voted on on Instagram, the one that I've already done, the tutorial you've already seen, and he's gonna do it. A bare face, I'm gonna go get all the stuff. You ready? Okay, so here's what's happening. I have laid out all the products in the order that I put them on and the brush with the appropriate product. <laughs> he just shook the lipstick. You got to. Get the microbiome to the top. Eyeshadow, and we use. So we're just gonna ignore the order that I put them in. Totally, right? Wait. Oh, you wanna do this first? Well, I think you should do what you wanna do. I just put it in the order that I apply. Okay. <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> put some up there. Okay, but I feel like Shh. you're being bad on purpose. Shh. Okay. It's like a wax on, wax off type of material. So what? I don't know what this is, to be honest. No, you're doing great. So what would you say that my skin concern is after looking at it? Is that eczema? <laughs> <laughs> no, you've heard me say this a million times. What's wrong with my face? Oh, you have that, uh, that dark stuff. It's <laughs> called, um, can you stop smiling? Keep your face straight. Thank you. So, oh, you need more. Yeah. Okay. Just right there. Look at me. <laughs> Are you fixing my mustache? Yeah, just a little in the hair, but it, it's fine. Well, if you move your hair. Okay. Thank you. Okay. What do you call this technique? Mr. Miyagi. Wax on. Wax on. What is this stuff called you have? Melasma. Melasma. Okay. Which uh, color did you do? This one? I used all three. Yeah, because you... Okay. It's like a paintbrush. Like, this part goes for, like, the, the parts that are, like... Yeah, clean that off. The harder to get to, and the bigger the brush is for the bigger the area. So what you went with is... Okay. Close your eyes, please. Okay. Can you tell me which order you went in? No, I think you should choose. I probably should have looked at your eyes before I did this. Okay. I think you go dark to light. Like, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay. That's what I'm going to do. 
Very <laughs> gentle application. How's it looking? <laughs> Close your eyes. Okay. I don't know. You look like a mermaid. Okay. That's a good thing. I don't know. I feel good about this. I don't. I'm not happy with it so far, but I think it'll be better what? once I blend it in, you know? Can I open yet? No. Yeah, you are up in my brow. Mm -hmm. Hold on, hold on. Okay. I'm use this thing to blend it. I feel like you're using the wrong brush based on what I'm feeling. Is that the bigger one or the smaller are one? Are you backseat driving? Okay. Yeah! Stop, stop. Okay. Close your eyes. Close your <gasps> eyes. I'm not done. Yeah. Oh, God. Ew, stop <laughs> spitting on me. I'm not a cat. Well, how else are you supposed to get this off? Oh well, my god, it's all underneath your eye. <laughs> looks like you have a black eye. Can you close your eye? Oh, that actually looks, that eye like, looks fire. This eye is ratchet. Okay, okay. you were Look gentle. At Look at me. Oh, that's actually not half bad. Come on. I'm sorry the lighting is so bad. He refused to go in another room and it's dark in here. That actually looks not half bad. I all right, now this part is for the foundation for the nude, but I already did. Yeah, but you wanted to cover it up some more. That, push that out like that. <laughs> you gotta do sound effects when you do it. Do you do it on your nose? Let's do this a little bit on your nose. Oh, that is bad there. The eyes don't actually look that bad. I know. Excuse me. Now, this part is the. Okay, okay. This is the. What do you call that? Can you read it? Are you curious? You use it for what you think it's for. What colors did you use? I personally use all of them. You used all four. Where the heck on your face does this go? This is the bronzer, everybody. They don't have directions on here. I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for those of you who can't see the palette, he's taking the darkest shade <laughs> in the bronzer quad and putting it under my eyes. You gotta like go with the face. Facial features. So. <laughs> then you go lighter. Okay. Down to the lower. So darker up top under my eyes and lighter as we get lower. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Bronzer done. This one is the blush. Oh, I know what blush is. But I just used the bronzer there. That's okay. How how like pink do you want your cheeks? You decide. Let's go for more neutral today. Wow. Excuse me. <laughs> Super search. Yeah. Looks okay. good. And then mascara time. Huh? This part is gonna be kind of hard because I got shaky hands. Close your eyes. My hands are so shaky. Oh. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. We'll get another yeah, wipe. it's fine. We'll get another wipe. We'll get a wipe. Close your eyes. I like how you're brushing down. Okay. Okay. Now for the final boom boom. Did you just shake the lipstick again? Mm-hmm. All right, you know it's not liquid, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Give me a... Give me a... Now let me get a little more look. You good? You done? All right, I mean... Some, Can you see what a for now? some circular no, blush, down. for sure. Um, the eyeshadow, let's see. It's questionable. Honestly, from far away, I thought it was fine, but it's not great. It's not. Honestly, you didn't do terrible. What What is a bronzer for? Bronzer is like for my, under my cheekbones to make me look sculpted and around my forehead. I'm gonna be honest, I expected a lot worse from you, Steven. Yeah? I really did. I washed it off though. I'm, I'm fresh faced again. So I feel like we're gonna call it for the day. That's that. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'm gonna link all the products that I used in my tutorial, which Steven used the same ones, he did great. So I'll link all those products that I use down below. They're all pre and probiotic, clean, microbiome friendly products. I'm gonna link my socials down below. Make sure you subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you next Monday. But first, what the people really wanna see. Hello, Bubby. Say bye. They see you on Monday. Bye bye. Hopefully.